What is going on guys? Apple World here. So for the first time ever in the channel, we're actually collabing with somebody who actually has a channel. Cat. And it's live here. Exactly. Cat from Cat4K. Exactly. The house. She's got an amazing... Actually, you want to introduce yourself? I have an amazing channel. <laughs> it's actually a tech... <laughs> what am I supposed to say? It's a tech channel, so I mean, you guys love tech, so links in the description. Today, we're actually going to do a video iPhone XS camera test versus Pixel 3. Oh, that's a big difference. Yep. Look at that difference. One is super light, one is super dark. One is super orangey. Oh, geez. Yeah, I like Which it. Which one do you prefer? I actually like mine. All right. Mine is a lot more saturated while yours has a lot more gray areas. Yeah, one way that I would actually describe the iPhone, whenever I compare it to like the S9, for example, mm -hmm. um, it's like what your eye actually sees. Mm -hmm. With Google and with Samsung, it always overexposes and oversaturates, uh -huh. which looks better, but then while editing, iPhone is the one. Yeah. Three has a wide-angle lens for selfies, thing that the iPhone XS doesn't. It's a thing. It's a feature that I actually love with the Google Pixel Three. But I, you have to be really careful not to put people in those edges of the angles. If not, what do they look like? Potatoes. A potato. like a Nazi, you know, like nine, nine, nine. It's not, I'm just joking. All right guys, so with the iPhone, you can actually do a long exposure while taking a live photo, swiping up just like that. And then on the right, as you guys can see, you guys can actually press long exposure and you're gonna get an effect like this one. What do you think of that? Can your wow. Google Pixel 3 do that? Wow, not my Google Pixel 3, but probably my uh, Huawei Mate 10 Pro, oh, which is what old is that? as hell. <laughs> By the way, check this out guys. Huawei Mate X, it's a huge poster. What do you think of the Huawei Mate X? Can I get your opinion on that? My opinion? Yeah, on the Huawei Mate X. It's a giant foldable phone that is super expensive. Why would you need that? <laughs> so you don't like it? No. Forget about the I, price. I'm, I'm like, I'm super practical. Forget about the price. You <laughs> like the product. Um, I like for what it represents. I like that it represents that it's more than one company trying to push the boundaries of Good. what mobile phones Good. are. Now, Samsung Fold or Huawei Mate X? That's the real question. I don't know. They're both foldable. All right, so here are both photos on portrait mode on both devices. Both of them look really good. The colors seem really good on both. Um, but if you guys actually see the Google Pixel 3, the hair, the left hair, it did not capture that too well. We're currently taking some photos. Colors look good. Take some of the pair. I'm so incredibly hungry. Aren't you hungry? I mean, look at this. No? You don't like fruit? I'll take a picture of this strawberry. All right, I'll take a photo of this strawberry. So this is La Boqueria. Um, I've showed you guys this before in the channel, but there's literally food everywhere. There's fruit, there's meat, there's fish, there's a lot of stuff, so it's good stuff. You like it so far? I don't know how you're not hungry. I mean, you just look at this Because I know it and I'm going to eat after this, so I'm just like saving myself. That's a good reason. All right, so look, there's white chocolate, black chocolate, there's potatoes over there. How are you not hungry? I'm, no, you don't even. 
I'm I'm annoyed. I guess with strong colors, iPhone will always win because it's not oversaturating. So if you have a bright orange by itself and you're oversaturating it in camera, it just becomes completely orange without any details. That's what that's what I was that's what I meant before. Like the pixel tries to improve your color which is great in most of the times but sometimes like the flower photos that you just saw which are these ones right here the iphone simply takes a better shot talking about the iphone well you look at that that's a beautiful don't you think that's beautiful no. what do you think about the, the scaffolding or the iphone 10r what do you think about the iphone 10r um it's a beautiful phone it's a beautiful piece of tech that's like it all apple products I never said they're not. Wow. <laughs> they're just not for me. <laughs> She's gonna become an Apple fanboy soon. Just wait for it. <laughs> Check this out guys. Fake AirPods. We've got AirPods for 10, 20, 25, 30. That's just Oh yeah, that, case. that's a case. Okay, yeah, they start so from 20, 25, 35, 40, and 50. These actually look good. But are there headphones in? Yeah, of course. But I mean, I I, I know that like they were selling also like one headphone. Yeah, yeah, I, I saw that. Yeah, I saw that. These look these look pretty good though. Oh, and look at these guys. Though these sound so bad, but they're I like the designs. They're pretty fun. Great. All right, guys. So the Google Pixel 3 has night shift which is a feature that allows you to take awesome photos at nighttime. So we're gonna go ahead and test it out. This is a photo with the iPhone XS. I'm not moving, I'm not moving, I'm not moving. And will you look at that? I mean, that's incredible, check it out. This is incredible, no? Oh, wow. Wow, I'm it really impressed. It actually looks good out there. What's that? That's that, Pixel. That's a Pixel 3. Pixel at night with night shift is yes. incredible. I'm sorry, Apple, this, but... This is a little bit blurry. And I wasn't, I, I did really my yeah. best not to move. Yeah, she barely moved. Just look at my hair. It looks like it's one big brownish blob. <laughs> wow, you, you look, you look... I have hair here. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> I feel like I haven't given enough credit to the Pixel 3 wide angle lens. I mean, seriously, look, look at this selfie right here. That's good, that's good. We're gonna hit a kid by a car, but Okay, but seriously, this wide angle is incredible. I really want wide angle selfies coming to the iPhone 11. Please, Apple, please. Yeah. Hey, yes. Merci. So I got a t-shirt. I didn't want to buy a t-shirt. Where is it? It's this one right here. Oh, I liked it. I didn't want to spend any money, but she didn't stop me, so. I tried. Oh, well, you tried. didn't? I tried, but like, I'm not gonna prevent you. Okay, I'm okay with that. All right, guys, so that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys enjoyed this video, Make sure to give it a big thumbs up. I hope you guys enjoyed this camera comparison slash vlog slash collab. Did slash you enjoy the video? Laughing things. Yeah, exactly. absolutely. It was a really imp improvised video, but I had a lot of fun. So thank you so much. Thank you. For, for coming in the channel. Please go subscribe. Links in the description. Check and out my channel. Yeah, it's just right here, right? <laughs> so just click on this channel. Go subscribe. Yes. You do her a favor and me a favor. So go. Tell them like that. Go, 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 go. I'm waiting here. You are? I mean, yeah, go. Yeah. I mean, she's not an Apple fanboy, but still click. Come on. <laughs>